so we are going to discuss IEEE formatting this document which we are seeing is the sample IEEE document this is the document uh, where we have stored the actual data and this is the final document which we are going to submit as an IEEE format so what we need to do is first fetch this copy and paste this should be of the size 24 in times now coming to the author we select all these documents first let's say copy and paste it there now we need to center align this author name should always be in font 11 it is in font 11 but now they are not in times for me we just select all of those and just say times new room this should be in courier now this should be in font size 11 it is already in 11 this should be in font size 10 and it should be italics this should be in font size 9 now we are going to set the page layout page layout should always the size should be selected as A4 and the margins should be set as follows top should be 0.75 inch bottom should be 1.69 inches left should be 0.56 inches right should be 0.56 same as right and then I will apply it to the whole document I will say ok and now go to home so now I need to copy and paste and also I need to set the number of columns I will select two columns with a spacing of 0.17 inches in between the two columns and I apply it to this point forward and I start to say ok now going to the main thing I will just copy and paste this Now from this I will take the abstract and paste it here. Now here it is written Times New Roman 9 bold. And just click there. Say Times New Roman 9 bold. So I got it. Now coming to the keywords, I will just copy this and paste it there. Now I fetch these keywords, I will say copy and I will paste it there. And the same format applies, so I can use format printer and just print it. Now coming to the introduction. I just copy this whole thing and paste it there. Now introduction should always be central line. It should be most easier. Now I select the entire text and just say times new Roman and font size 10. fetch the next document next paragraph just say copy and paste it there this I will center line I will click on this and the format painter and paint the entire text Now we will go to the next paragraph. I will just copy this and paste it there. So here I have the 
center line I'll use the format painter once again and just paint it now I'll go to the next paragraph next three paragraphs in fact I'll till the conclusion I'll just copy them and paste it there so again I center line this and use format printer and paint the whole thing again center line use format printer same case with conclusion as well use the format printer and center line now I to come into the references just copy it and paste it there there is some problem here this can be tackled later on Format Painter. Just paint the entire thing. Now coming to the references. You say backspace. Select everything. Go to this. Go to the number format there. the time to do this I'll go there select this thing say ok select this go to the forms say it as small caps now I use this format painter option go and paint the second thing comes to you can use the format painter Use this format printer again. In the fourth format printer, in the fifth format printer, in the sixth. This is left blank. Now, references should always be in font size 8. So I go there, this reduce the font size to 8. This is how final paper is done. Just need to justify this a bit. Next done. Thank you.